um, Roscoe John and a vocalist songwriter for the band Archive. When I really started thinking about making music, uh, it was electronic, it was kind of hip hop to begin with and kind of went through like jungle, drum and bass. And, and then it's just slowly broadened since then as kind of dance music has in itself, you know, forms are being reinvented every day. You know, that, that's what kind of really got me into the possibility of being able to make my own music. It was something that I, I loved doing and had a dream of having, you know, my own studio when I was in my kind of early teens. Um, and used to enjoy just uh, vocaling over instrumentals, kind of hip-hop instrumentals. I'd just, you know, try freestyling and coming up with, uh, you know, nice vocal ideas, nice vocal lines. I'd had a, a, a good amateur boxing career and maybe thought that I could do something within that as well. You know, I didn't, I didn't really think too much about, you know, what I was going to do. Uh, music, I enjoyed it. I never really saw it as being a job. Being on stage has been uh, amazing because you hold up in the studio for the you know, best part of a year, year and a half, maybe more. And then to take it to the stage in front of a crowd, um, it was actually a first time for me with Archive to, to, to kind of play live to the, the size, you know, the amount of people that they have come into their shows. And it was, it was absolutely amazing. Um, it's a, a rush unlike any other. The name Archive, uh, cropped up in the, pretty much the first conversation uh, Darius and I had um, you know, when we first decided we were going to work together uh, on a project. We were on the roof of a block of flats that we, we were both living in, having a cup of tea, and we, we talked about you know, what had been uh, done with music before, especially electronic music, and uh, you know, where we could take it. But in order to take it somewhere, you have to draw on where it's been. So we kind of, almost like the archive of music, like the resources, you know, we always listen to music together um, uh, and discuss what we like, what we didn't like. So the kind of name archive came up in conversation and it was almost, you know, just archive, great name for a band. Darius nodded and that was it. You know, I, I still think that the things that we discussed in the, you know, the first conversation before the band started, I think they're still there, but it's just broadened. It's just been added to over, over time. I can only really say that I've actually observed what people get from, from archive music from the tour, you know, the last 12 months. And it's, for some people, I honestly can say, I think they find it a religious experience, especially a lot of the kind of, you know, the, the older songs like uh, Lights and Again, uh, you know, they. You know, you watch them in the crowd, they've got their eyes closed, you know, it's almost like they're at church. But I just think they... It's, it's an outlet for them as well, as, as far as them coming to a show. You know, they, they kind of get to, you know, deal with any stresses or anxieties, fear that they've got inside them. They come to a show and it just all gets blown away, you know. That makes me feel wonderful, yeah, absolutely. It's something that Archive have built up over the last 10 years. Um, and you know, to be able to kind of see it firsthand is a pretty amazing experience.